What up guys, it's your boy Luke Thomas and Y here today with a new boxing video for your viewing pleasures. I know it's been a while since I've done one of these. This one's going to kind of just be like a quick easy one. Um, today I'm unboxing the Elgato HD60S uh, capture card, which is uh, Elgato's USB-C variant of their uh, capture card. Uh, the benefits of this over the normal HD60 are going to be that you get a lot lower latency out of your USB uh 3.0 connection versus out of your uh, you know standard USB 2.0 connection with the old HD60 model. Um, this works great for the uh, PS4 and PS4 Pro, Xbox One X and S, and original Xbox One. And then what I'm going to be using it for is the Nintendo Switch, which it works really well for as well. Um, this can capture directly into OBS, XSplit, or just about any of your other like broadcasting recording software. Uh, so yeah, without any further ado, I'm going to go ahead and open the box up here. <clears throat> Alright, got the wrapper off. This just slides out like this. This box, let's see, how does this open? Opens at the top. Oh no, it flips open on the front here. It says, what's it say? Game Capture HD60S. Download the Elgato Game Capture HD software to get started. You don't have to do that, though. You can just plug this in and use this with, like, OBS or something, as far as I know. I don't think you need to actually go on and download their software, but you can if you want to use that for game capture purposes. Um, so here's the device itself. It's nice and slim. Like, if we were to compare it to something else, like, here's a PlayStation Vita, randomly, for example. You can see... That it's a lot shorter than the Vita. It's basically the same width as the Vita. Um, it's a little bit smaller than like an external hard drive. It basically looks a lot like a two and a half inch like Western Digital ex external hard drive. Um, but yeah, inside of the box you also get. Let's see. The USB Type C to USB 3.0 cable. Which I was honestly hoping was going to be a Type C to Type C cable. I didn't realize that the one end had the USB like 2.0, 3.0 style on it. Uh, it is a USB 3.0 cable. You can tell by the blue end, and if you were to look inside, you'd see the extra pins back there. Um, but the other side is definitely that new upgraded USB Type C connection, reversible, so you can plug it in either way, and uh, much higher speed than traditional USB. And then also just a uh, Standard HDMI cable doesn't look very long. Doesn't really, I guess, need to be as long as you, everything is right next to each other. It's probably like a three-foot cable if I had to guesstimate. Uh, and then it looks like you get an Elgato sticker too. That's exciting. Happy about that. Um, I like stickers. Um, now the device itself on it, you've got a few ports. You've got an audio input. Um, so you can do like external audio mixing if you want to do your own like soundtracks while capturing and stuff like that. Um, you've got HDMI in, and then you've got the USB-C uh, out, and then you've got HDMI out. Uh, so yeah, HDMI in, audio in, USB-C out on that side, HDMI out on this side. Uh, nothing on either other side, and then this little guy here lights up when you've got it plugged in. Uh, let's see, I could probably go ahead and do that right now, just to show you. I guess the main reason I wanted it to be Type-C was to leave the USB port free on my laptop, which is where I'm mainly going to be using this thing. I guess it's not a huge deal that it's regular USB, because I probably won't really need my headset. Or my mouse while I'm using this, so I can probably always leave one of those other things unplugged. Oop. I'm sure you guys just heard everything ding. But as you guys saw, that little bar just lit up. Let me do that one more time. Unplug. Plug it back in. Lights up white. And the last time it lit up red. I'm assuming it's because it's not set up properly or whatever yet, but... Uh, but yeah, you know, that's the Elgato HD60S. Um, so yeah, you know, thank you guys for watching the video. If you guys like this, found this helpful at all, informative, 
funny at all? Probably not. Um, make sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe, and come back for more content later. As always, this is your boy Luke Thomas and Y saying goodbye for now. I'll catch you guys next time.